All right. Okay, so today I just wanted to do a quick little uh, presentation of why we're doing all this stuff. What is Easter about? Why are we here? So let me just talk real quick. So we all know, I hope that you know, that God made everything. And God created the whole world, everything you see around us. But also God made you, God made me. God made all creation and all people. But in the beginning, when God made us, he made us perfect and pure. Like this water. It's clean. You can drink it. In fact, someone has been drinking this. <laughs> so God made us pure and perfect and clean, just like this. But the first man, Adam, sinned against God. Good. Sinned against God. And so here I have, it's basically iodine, but Adam sinned against God. Oh, no. oh my God. And since that time, we have been dirty like this water. Now this iodine, you can't drink this. So before you could drink this water, but now if you drink it, you get very sick. Don't drink this. So now, since that time, because of the sin of our father Adam, man is made sinful. We're born this way. But not only are we born in sin, but we also commit our own sins, right? So sometimes we tell a lie. Sometimes we take something that doesn't belong to us. Sometimes we say a bad word. And often we don't honor God the way he deserves. God deserves our worship, but we don't do that, do we? We don't love others like, um, like God loved us. We love ourselves. And so more and more we're covering in sin and we're dirtier and dirtier before the Lord. Now, I used to think that maybe if you, maybe you can even it out. I do some good stuff for the bad stuff that I do. But that doesn't work, does it? If I add more clean water, does this water get clean? No, it doesn't. I can, I can add all this water and it's not going to get any cleaner. You still can't drink this water. It's still dirty. This is still poisonous. Okay. There's nothing that we can do to get rid of our sin. There's nothing that we can do to get closer to God on our own. And God knew this because God is wise and he made everything. And so on Easter we celebrate a fact that God sent his son, Jesus, to live and to die and to rise again. And that's what we're going to be celebrating on Easter Sunday. And if you have the love of Christ, only Christ can cleanse us of our sins. Only Christ can clean away all of our impurities. Only Christ can take away the sin that's in our hearts. And even if we have sin, now we're still not going to be perfect just because you believe in Jesus. It doesn't mean all of a sudden overnight you're going to be perfect. But even if we sin, Jesus covers all of our sins, past, present, and future. And no matter how much sin we have, we can always turn to the cross. We can always turn to Christ. God's grace and mercy never end for those who believe in him. That's what it says, For God so loved the world that he gave his only son, that whoever believes in him shall not perish, but have eternal life. We can be with him forever and ever and ever. That's Amen. Thank you. Woo!